do you know? We can call out the data or showcase the Jira data into Tableau, which is an exceptional potential for opportunity when it is properly analyzed and visualized. A good analysis enables businesses to visualize the complex relationship within the data to understand difficult concepts or identify new patterns. So if you can see here in Tableau Fair form, we have called the data and presented in graphical node. So if I want to change the graph, simply I will click on this and that will be updated successfully. So based on the trend, I can see the complete reports generated here. So we'll see here how we can integrate Tableau with Jira, which is amazing part of add-on created by Alpha Surf team. Now I am on Jira Cloud. Here I have active sprints, even backlog sections, and I can see all the project details here. For connecting with Jira Cloud, simply we have to navigate it to the app sections and click on manage your apps. Once I will click on manage our apps, simply click on find new apps. Here we will get that add on available. So I'm just writing tab view connector, search on this and select this options. And here we have options available. And this add on has been built by Alpha Serve team. I've already installed. That's why I can see inside the manage app, but otherwise you'll be able to see right now. So once you'll click on the right now, that will be available for 30 days, absolutely free of cost. After that, you have to make a payment and you can use the services based on the licensing model. You can see complete detail about certifications and about add on detail here in the marketplace sections. And if if you have any queries, maybe you can reach out to the Alpha Sir team. They will help you out on this part. Now, once you will be installed, we have to install all Tableau as well. So I've already installed. I will mention the link in the description tab so that you can refer the Tableau sections and install the Tableau in your system. Post that we need to have add-on and Tableau installed in your system. After that, we will create a data source from connectors and Jira token. For creating a Jira token, simply go to id.atlassian.com, manage profile security and API tokens. Again, I will include this URL in my description tab so that you will be able to easily access it. Click on create API token, simply give the name of your API. So I'm just writing Jira cloud or maybe any name click on create this will generate api token for you just like this and copy this api token and that will need it for connecting tableau with jira cloud so as of now i'm using tableau connector so i i don't want this i will revoke this and we have tableau connector available once you are done with the api tokens just open this tableau before that we need to create a data source at the time of creating a data source after installation simply click your tableau connector for jira once you'll select the tableau connector for jira it will navigate you to this page now i'm just navigating into the different sections so that you will be able to understand in a better way so this is a documentation sections of alpha Surf where you can have all the details about this connector click on connectors this will take some time to load the page once it will be loaded we have to create a data source by using this data source we are able to successfully fetch the data from jira to Tableau. Click on create data source and here we have to define the name. So my data source name is uh, Jira with Tableau. Enter the descriptions and in share settings, either 
you can add the selected groups if if you want to enable the group section so you can enable it otherwise you can also include the user specific details so as of now i'm including my name here now this is done uh, as a part of share setting after that here we have three options either we will select on the all once we will select on all everything is available into that sections if you want to select with the GQL statement, we can also select the GQL statement which we have created here or even with the filter. I don't want to go ahead with this. Apart of that, we also have one options as basic. So whatever options you want as a product sections, then issue types as well as status, then created by select all this field and click on apply. These fields will be available here. But I'm going ahead with the all, so I don't want to use these two sections. A part of that, we can showcase this view options from the settings. Now, here, if you want to add the different field sections, we can include it from here. I don't want to go ahead with the Jira work management, so I will select uh, Jira software. From here, we can select different fields, totally depending on our requirement even if we are selecting with these sections we can have all this settings are available now i am selecting this issue effort parent issues work logs issue custom fields then we have issue label status issue types versions project component projects histories so I'm selecting everything, role, user, time, status, issue with affected versions. And now click on save. So once you we'll click on save, this will be created successfully. So totally depending on our requirement, how you want to proceed ahead, we can create it and we will use this URL to be connected with the data source and Tableau. So I was using the Jira data, uh, data earlier. So I will go ahead with this one and I will add in a part of web connector. So just paste this link and hit enter. Now, after that, it will ask us to enter the username and password of our Jira login credentials. So here we'll use exactly same username which we are using for Jira login. And after that, I will add the token ID. So I've already copied this token ID. I will paste it and click on login and export. This will take some time uh, to get connected Tableau with Jira. Once this is connected, we can see here, all the table which we have selected is available here. Just drag and drop the informations and you can see all the details are listed here which is very easy to connect and even we can see all the data are listed here so it's totally up to us how we can drag and drop and which all informations we want we can select it and see the details listed here now if i want to showcase uh, this data in graphical format simply i will go ahead with the go to worksheets and here we have column and rows. So in column sections, I'm just adding issue type ID or maybe I will select issue status ID. And then I will select here issue count. So if you can see here, this graph is enabled. I will just toggle it or change this graph and see the graphical representations are available even if, if you want we can go ahead with the project id as well so from here we can see the project id details so exactly whatever we want we can showcase all this informations as per our need so this will help us to connect or analyze the data which is available in jira which is an interesting add-on created by alpha serve team maybe we can start using it for analyzing any of our data or project data we can analyze how much time it took for working 
of any functionality maybe we can analyze on the epic sections if you want to share this detail with the business team we can just extract it and share it so it's totally up to us how you want to use this add-on for business point of view so that's all from this video hope you enjoyed the content if you think so we can also utilize in a better way please add your use case in comment section so that will be helpful for other users to get started with tableau connector for jira thank you for watching